Kiko Martinez versus Josh Warrington, part two. What does Yuzi think? Um, I think it's a tough one to call. The first fight, Martinez was suffocating Warrington from the first six rounds, really in his face. Um, Warrington has not looked the same since the two Lara fights. Um, and I think the only reason the other was can stop because of the cut. Um, and he probably would have lost that anyway. Uh, but I don't think Martinez has got the punch that Lara did. And now Warrington knows that whatever Martinez throws, I don't think it's going to knock Warrington out. It only stopped Galahad because they were flush shots, what he wasn't expecting, because Galahad's a different sort of fighter. He's not like a pressure fighter. He's more of a technical boxer. So on this, I'm go I've got a feeling, even though Warrington didn't blast Martinez out in the first one, so this is a tricky one, and it could be the beginning and the end for Warrington, or a new beginning. And I get the feeling... I don't know, because Martinez is, is running down the clock and that's the only thing I'm thinking. Maybe the performance a few years back was when he was pretty much at his peak and I think that was after he fought Scott Quigg. It was. Um, and Carl Frampton. And he was still good in that. But he's been through a lot of wars and I don't think this fight is going to be any different. I think it's going to be another war and Warrington's going to throw everything at it because now... He really needs that win back and he's going to come more focused. And I think he's going to try and box a little clever as well. But Martinez is in your face all the time, so it's hard to sort of box against him. But um, keep him off with a jab because he's always in your face. But I've got a feeling that Warrington's going to pull it off based on the fact that he's got a lot more to prove now. That he's lost one and drawn one and he was undefeated. He's um, 32 fights and f um, 30 wins, so... For me, I think Warrington, um, personally, I think he's just going to edge it. Um, I don't think it's going to be a knockout. I think it's going to be another point. Uh, I just think he's got a good chin, Warrington. The, only, the, the fight against Lara were different. Lara has a certain sort of punch that was like ridiculous power. I don't think Martinez has that. He just has a um, volume. And Warrington, I think, will deal with the volume. And it'll go on points and I'm, I'm edging Warrington on a point I am 78 and um no I'm not I'm 86 sorry I'm, I'm 86 and 16 on fight predictions so there you go yeah so let's get it to 87 I think and I've lost count you know what I'm saying but yeah peace Warrington